everyone, Ziggy here from Ziggy Zag and today we are here in Il Corso and we'll check out Lantau Native Restaurant. Guys, presenting to you the Cebu landscape. We are now at the SMC side premises. This building right here is the Chapel of San Pedro Calungsod. And beside it is the Cebu Ocean Park. And that building right there is the New Star Resort and Casino. It is Cebu's premier five-star integrated resort, redefining luxury with world-class gaming, entertainment, events, and exclusive shopping and dining offerings. Construction is still ongoing, however, they are already in their soft opening phase. And this is the Il Corso Mall. So we are now in one of the entryways of Il Corso. And as you can see, yeah. it is amazing. This is one of the reasons that makes El Corso a unique place to visit when you're here in Cebu. Would you look at that? It's B E A beautiful. Hi guys, we are heading off to Lantau Restaurant. Nice place, huh? The view and the feel here makes you think you're in another country. Walking ahead, here is another section of Il Corso. It's like a food street. La Mesa. Humba Heaven. Also, Larshan by the Sea, Sutokil. Expect those establishments to be busy during dinner time. Welcome to Lantau Native Restaurant. Let's check this out. Lantau is a Cebuano word and can be translated as sight. Lantau is very fitting in naming their restaurants because they make sure that their location has great view and definitely a sight to see. They also have individual tables for a more private dining experience overlooking the ocean. They got a second floor. That bridge in the distance is the CC Lex. This body of water is the Cebu Strait. You can see the Il Corso Mall from here. That is where I park. But don't worry guys, they have a parking nearby. I will also have a separate video where I had dessert and coffee there in Il Corso. On this side, you can see the mountain view of Cebu. <laughs> and that building right there we passed by earlier, that is the new star. From here, you get a good view of the dining area of the ground floor. Really nice! Here's their menu card and you can see all the food choices that they offer. On the back of the menu, you could see the drinks, fresh shakes, and dessert options that they offer. Each table has a setup of soy sauce, vinegar with spices, and some napkins. So 
So this is what I ordered guys. Ginataang munggo. Big scallops. Lumpia. And garlic rice. Woo! Yummy. Let's eat. Big scallops. Garlicky, it's really good. Pinataang munggo. Woo! It's also good. And of course, lumpia. It has a sweet and sour dipping sauce. Flavorful, still salty, still good. Yum. See how garlicky and cheesy the baked scallops. Woo! Guys, I also ordered frozen iced tea. Looks really good. Let's see if it tastes good as it looks. It's a little sweet and uh, strong tea taste. I like the strong tea taste, but the sweetness a tad bit much for me. And that was it guys. Clean plate. For the ambiance and the overall feel of the place, I definitely give it a 10. For the food service, it's a 9.5. A minor concern is there are some fruit flies around. There goes one. But overall, the place is nice. The view is excellent. Food is good. It's definitely worth a try when you're here in Sudan. That was it guys. We're here in Il Corso. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And please consider subscribing to my channel. And remember, life is not a straight line, but a zigzag. Sometimes you're up, sometimes you're down. But always keep moving forward.